Hi guys, welcome to another episode of the Draft of Glory, the series where we're taking um, 300 FIFA points and turning it into 2.8 million. That's basically what we've done in this series uh, throughout the year. You can see we've made a lot of money uh, with the marquee matchups from last week as well. I don't think there's any more money to be made either uh, with the current SBCs which are out, but you can see there's quite a bit there, uh, which is pretty nice. And obviously this stuff, which I'm going to try and... Um, actually, can I sell Marvel win? 2.9. I'll hold on to him again. I'll send him to the club. I was gonna hold I was gonna sell him, but I'm gonna hold on to him again. Sell all that stuff and clear the rest. So the aim this week, guys, there isn't really an aim. The footies are out. Um also I'm trying to think what else is out. I don't think there's much out. But we're gonna go into it anyway. If you guys want any MSP, PSN codes or cheat game codes, guys, go and check out G2A.com. Their link is down below. If we try and hit over 5,000 likes, that'd be brilliant. And guys, subscribe to me if you're not subscribed already. Now I'm tempted to try, like that won't be an easy formation to go with, but I'm tempted to try this one to see what we can do. And I'm gonna go with it. I'm hopefully like I wanted to try this one for my main team anyway, to see what it's like. We get Iron Robin right mid. And it will put him right back. Uh, okay, uh, let's go with. Probably going to be Suarez. He's only a Pastoria works, but um, I'll go with Suarez. See what we can get there. If we can get like the, I think there's a hero Messi in there, uh, which is purple. Pastor, we get a decent Pastor card. I'll take that now. Um, next cam. Dempsey, Ganzo. Tiago. Ganzo's like 37 pace and it'd be a good central uh, one. Tiago's not bad either. Uh, so I'll take Ganzo now. Um, and now we need. We definitely do need that Messi. We need that Messi right now. Giliano. We've been screwed already with the picks. Um, I'll take Giliano, but I don't know which way I'm going with this team yet. It's still not sorted. We get Sanson. We get Gonlons, which is a transfer card to Roma as well. Uh, Sanson. Yeah, I'll take... There's no one else in there, is there? I'll take Sanson, but I don't think it's going to work. Next pick. Toulon. Veloso. San Jose. And that's a... No, it's a weak link again. I'm getting sort of screwed here. Getting sort of screwed with which way I want to go. I'll take San Jose for the La Liga. Because we've got a few already. We're at 42 chemistry. Um, definitely need some changes to this team. I was hoping to get that messy, but it's just not popped. We get Felipe Luis. We get Kazawa um, as well. Which would be a good... Felipe Luis wouldn't, wouldn't work. Uh, let's go with Kazawa. And let's flip this team around. Put him there. And put him there. 55. Still very messy. Right back. Looking for team season Carvajal. Or some sort of Spanish. We get Vidal uh, for the strong link San Jose. Two centre backs. So I could do with a team of season silver. For Tongan. Doesn't really work. Julian, Julian does. Julian, sorry. Uh, does work. Uh, so I'll take him. And then Spanish centre back. And it's not popped. Uh, Spanish centre back hasn't popped. Uh, German. Pretty rough picks. Pretty rough picks. I'll go a Rudiger. And then the final one of the uh, Stein 11 guys is a crap goal. Oh my god. What has even happened with this draft? I'll take Sergio. That is disgusting. That is a disgusting start to the draft. We get, right, we get all black. Um. There was no... F oh, there is Lloris, actually. I could take Lloris. I'll take Lloris for the French link. Uh, 86 chem. Moving on to the defence. We need a Spanish centre-back. But it's giving us low-rated picks all the time. Um, I'll take Alonso. I don't know why I took Alonso. I'll just take him. A Spanish centre-back. We've got one. We get Valencia as well. But I'll take Ruiz for Rudiger now. Takes us to 95 chem. We just need to sort out that cam position in area. It's a very low-rated team, though. That's uh, some of which is definitely noticeable. Nangolan, I don't think would appear, but could be a nice super sub anyway. We'll go with him. Next one. Come on, give us someone good. Matic, Vidal, 
Perisic, Kadira. I don't think we've done... Actually, we have got a, a, a nice bunch of Roma players. Nemanja Matic at CDM. Um, I don't think any of this works anyway. So we'll just take that 91 rated Vidal. Nice card as well. And now the striker. If we can change the striker, that would be the... Oh, 98 rated Ronaldo. <laughs> yes, please. Let's take that 98 rated Ronaldo um, as a bit of a super. There's also the Lacazette card, not transferred either. Now we get the free picks to make the changes. So I'm hoping we can get some nice players in this team now um, to finish it off. And it's mainly going to be a cam. We'll take Jao Mario. Not many picks left. Danilo right back, top rack, Neymar. Now, I might take Neymar as a cam to see if it sorts it. Valencia, Matthew. Um, Di Maria. I think Matthew jumped straight on into the team and actually would get. Yeah, he would get some players, some full cam as well. So we'll take Matthew uh, for defence, taking us up to 98. Let's get this team sorted. So we're taking out him. And. I think that's the way we're going to work it. What's even Messi on? So we've got full cam apart from two players. So we need a cam. Sort of. Let's see. Loic Remy. Eden Hazard. Lewandowski. Let's take that Eden Hazard because he's always going to be a, a game changer. Two more picks. We've not had the silver picks yet either. Costa, Schweinsteiger, Toure. Uh, let's go with... We're basically sorted in some ways. I probably missed someone. I'll go with a 90 rated Costa, uh, even though I'm not going to use him. This is presumably going to be the silver pick now, which it is. So we get no one, no one to go into the team. And um, maybe if we do it like this, take him out, put him there, 96. Absolutely no point. So we'll keep it as it was. Keep Ronaldo as a super sub. Uh, put Guliano back in. Swap them to round. Drops it by 11. It's a very crap draft. It is a very crap draft. But I was—I don't think I was gifted nice picks. To my knowledge. I don't think I was gifted nice picks to, 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 uh, to my knowledge. I probably could be wrong, guys. I'm, obviously, I've made the decisions already. I'll have to wait and find out if I did make the wrong decisions. But I think EA sort of screwed me. I don't know. We shall have to wait and see. So that's the team. Game changes on the bench. Decent attack force. Giuliano hopefully would do the business. But I'm not very confident in the CDMs and defence. But anything can happen with drafts. So guys, we'll see who we get as a manager to finish it off. La Liga is going to be the dream. And you can tell guys at the state of the draft. So that'll take him to four. Brazilian in it. We're going to go with the Brazilian manager. There we go. Boom. Done. Pretty crap draft, but that's what draft is like this year. So let's see how we do, guys. Hopefully do all right. Four games. Hopefully picking up a draft win at the end. So guys, moving on into the first draft of the week. First uh, opponent, guys, rocks up with a nice looking team with team of the year, uh, uh, Messi, team of season for Tongan, and uh, team of, uh, sorry, Inform Alderweireld, Inform Insigne, Inform Dybala, Inform Mertens, and Inform um, Valdez, some of the main players in his team, and also uh, Biglia in the CDM position. A nice ball out to the wing here, caught by Mertens. I know how dangerous Mertens is, and uh, he caused a lot of trouble, guys. The ball bounces to Biglia, who wasn't really the standout player in his team, putting my opponent. 1-0 up um, just uh, before the 20th minute. A really, really annoying goal to concede because I thought I had the better of the possession and the better of the play. But thankfully, that goal did give me a kick up the ass and also made my opponent put his control down for some weird reason. As we tie it up instantly with Ronaldo just running straight through his defence and powering it into the bottom corner. In injury as well. Didn't really make a difference. Ronaldo threw to uh, San Jose. San Jose all the way down to Eden Hazard and a brilliant slide chip there over the keeper makes it 2-1 in the 21, uh, 25th minute sorry, and that uh, does put us in a nice position. So this week guys is going to be some talking points throughout the draft to glory. Uh, I have got a few episodes already lined up for you guys ready so there is going to be a guaranteed numerous amount of uh, draft to glory this week but if you guys do follow me on Twitter and uh, interestingly enough you're not blocked <laughs> which I know a lot of you potentially are there's been some discussion 
Now, this series, guys, it doesn't really have an end goal. I've set the end goal. 3 million is going to be the end of the series. That's going to be the uh, limit. I wasn't set at episode 200, but I am going to set the limit to uh, 3 million. As soon as we made 3 million, we probably made it over there. But as soon as there's 3 million coins in the bank, guys, this series is over and done with. Now, with the lack of interest EA have shown in the draft this year, it's been pretty upsetting, actually, because... For people, like I'm not saying I'm one of the best FIFA players around because I'm definitely not, but draft I've been able to manipulate and uh, obviously get good packs. Now, I'm not saying 3 million is nothing to be made from draft, but it's been very, very long term. We've played a hell of a lot of drafts and you guys have seen every single one recorded in this series. But EA have shown no love to it. There's been no change at all. The reward system is absolutely the worst um, and does not benefit the really, really good players unless you completely ground, grind it out. Now, with the addition of new New packs this FIFA you would expect EA to do some work and maybe um, try to make the game more better but they definitely haven't touched it and it's really frustrating to see uh, such a new game mode to the series not get that love it definitely deserves um, so with that said guys draft the glory probably will not return in it might return in fifa 18 but it may be a little bit different dependent so what i did was i put a straw poll no just a twitter poll actually on twitter asking what people would prefer to see a draft of glory or a road to glory now the the reason why i've been off put by a road to glory isn't because um I would struggle at it. It's one of the reasons where it's a time frame issue. Now, I see the likes of Nick. I see the likes of Nepenthes, even Fuji as well, the guys who do the decent Road to Glories this year, and they struggle at it. Now, back in FIFA 16... No, 15, I think it was, when I did my my Road to Glory. There wasn't really an end goal there. Um, so basically, we built a team, we built it to win, we didn't do any trading, we literally just played to win, won Division 1, that was game over, there was nothing else to do. So... With that, and the addition of foot champions this year, guys, uh, I probably should have continued doing it, but I stopped my World to Glory for FIFA 17 because of the fact... Um, that I was just bored after eight episodes I was bored of it there was no competition we didn't really understand how foot champions was going to work we didn't understand how the reward system would work either and uh, therefore it did excite me so as of FIFA 18 guys you will be seeing packs you will be seeing best possibles you will be seeing all that good stuff on my main account but foot champions and everything else is going to be done a different way now I had the dream of going professional FIFA player I'm not at that caliber as soon as I come up against a pro FIFA player guys I'm garbage I'm too old for this type of stuff um, and I just enjoy being a, a pub stomp you know so what we're going to do is we're going to do a road to glory we're going to do it pretty well as well and uh, throughout this week guys in between the highlights and stuff i'm going to discuss exactly what is going to be going down in the future and uh, hopefully you guys are excited for that as well but now i don't really i enjoy draft don't get me wrong I, I really do enjoy draft it's just the rewards and what i can offer for you guys in the video is isn't that much now i am a shit drafter that is a given i am a really really bad drafter you guys have pointed out numerous amount of times in my videos but to say that this series is a failure it definitely isn't guys for someone to have 2.8 million coins on the account uh, after uh, 189 episodes maybe 190 close to 200 um it is pretty uh, pretty sweet but it's been a massive grind, and it's definitely not been beneficial for you guys to watch. Now, at least with the Road to Glory, I can get some input from you guys, and uh, that more than likely is going to be what we talk about uh, in the future. So this game starts off 1-0. Um, we get a nice goal. This is the final as well. A bad clearance there by, I think, Sergio Ramos. Link gets it back into the possession of um, uh, Suarez, who turns nicely, squares it through, and a simple finish for Ronaldo near the end of the game, which is all well and good. But then my opponent did get a nice bite, and it was from me fucking up in defence, uh, Royce dispossesses him and he's able to uh, smash it into the right corner, too little too late though guys as we do push on for a draft victory again, and there we are guys, a draft victory again uh, I can't remember the last time I lost in draft uh, but looking pretty good for the win as well in this game, tough game but we did take a 2-0 lead and then a defensive error by myself let my opponent in to make it 2-1 but 4 games won on the bounce and uh, you can see 3-1, 3-1, 4-0 and 2-1 to finish off with and we get a mega pack, a mega pack and a premium gold pack as well. Uh, so not bad for consumables. Player wise I'm not going to be expecting the best but all the players we do get anyway guys I'll be sending to the club uh, for future SBCs. Consumables I'll be getting rid of like I did say. Um, also 1000 coins there as well. Do we try and sell them? I don't know how much contracts sell for now. 
Don't allow yourself, so we're not going to bother with them. Take the thousand coins, um, send the players to the club as I've sent them to the trade pile, and then discard the rest. So, moving on to the two mega packs, guys 18 rare players um, in them. There is some Team of the Week players as well, and we get Gomez, the uh, striker from Wolfsburg. Not bad. 82 rated. I don't think they sell for an inflated amount at the moment. Let's see how much he goes for. 18950. No, I'll definitely hold on to the players. Um, get him into consumables, though. All of them. Attributes don't sell. Oh, draft token. That's something we haven't had for a while. Uh, a draft token we have not had for a while. And we get another pack as well. So I'll keep the. That's the first draft token I've had in ages. So that's a free 15k there. Plus a thousand coin redeem. So we're in the profit anyway, regardless um, here, guys. And like I said, uh, I will discard all this, uh, which is RT. And uh, send all the players uh, to the club. Just keep them there, ready and waiting anyway. Unless, it's, unless actually, guys, I do get um, some new transfer players. I forgot about the new transfer players. So we could hit a transfer player, which we will sell. Uh, keep them. Actually, that player we just got there might be worth something. Last mega pack. No walkout. Some two big flares. Glick is the main 184 rated Glick. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Glick Adaris, not bad. Jesus. I need to be, like on this account, I'm not even 100% sure which players are transferred and which ones aren't. Uh, we have got a um, Premier League manager there. Get rid of him. Offload all that good stuff. Uh, and the healing as well. And the position changes. And the league. And that badge. And that player. And the rest will just discard, guys. So there we are for an episode of the uh, Draft to Glory. Not bad rewards. Obviously, we got a decent um, 15k back with the uh, with winning the draft. And two things have sold. Them two, which we'll get rid of. And uh, all this stuff we're going to be selling. Uh, so you'll probably see it in the last episode of this week, guys. But we have got some nice stuff there. Fingers crossed we can get some better stuff throughout the week and maybe even get on and uh, use them consumables. Uh, no, them players we start in the club uh, for future SBCs which we can sell for an inflated amount. Hopefully, anyway. So, guys, leave a like, rate, and subscribe. Or not back again with another video for you guys to enjoy.